Hi, my name is Walter and I'm currently a postdoc researcher at the University of Copenhagen. I am the leader of an European funded project called Mediterranean Coral Performance under warming and iron enrichment conditions. In this project, we aim to evaluate the health status of corals and in particular Mediterranean corals to current ocean warming and to evaluate the role of inorganic iron in the coral physiology. We selected a site located within the Portofino Marine Protected Area in Italy, as this location offers easy access to healthy coral colonies. Our study primarily focused on the examination of two species, the Sony coral Cladocora cespitosa and the Gorgonia neonicella singularis. Using scuba diving, we collect the coral sample at a depth of approximately 15 to 20 meters. Then the samples were carefully placed in well ventilated containers and then transported to the scientific center in Monaco for laboratory analysis. Upon arrival at the laboratory, the coral colonies were carefully fragmented to create nubbins for our experimental investigation. These nubbins were then placed in different aquaria and given a two week period for acclimation before commencing the actual experiments. This time frame allowed the corals to relax and adapt to the new environment. Several conditions were used to replicate distinct seawater scenarios. Natural condition at 18 degrees, elevated temperature at 24 degrees, and simulated iron enrichment for a total of five week experiment. Given that corals are invertebrate organisms engaged in symbiotic relationship with microalgae, our study involved conducting both dark and light incubations. These incubations serve to quantify the respiration rates evaluated as oxygen consumption in dark condition and the photosynthetic rates measured as oxygen production in the light for at least 60 minutes. Custom-made chambers were created from transparent polycarbonate to suit the distinct coral morphologies and align with our experimental design. These chambers with a volume of approximately 50 ml were equipped with a steering magnet at the base facilitating the water circulation within. The placement of the oxygen sensor spot on the inner surface along with the connection of the fiber optic through 3D printed connectors ensured a continuous measurement of oxygen concentration. Using the Fasting Pro configuration, we successfully recorded the oxygen content within the chamber facilitating the assessment of coral metabolic rates. To illustrate the data processing procedure, we retrieve measurements from each session and use the data software to apply smoothing techniques and calculate the linear rates. With this process, we can quantify the respiration and gross photosynthesis rates and calculate the PR ratio as a standard of coral energetic productivity. These insights improve the significance in understanding the changes in coral physiology under different conditions and in quantifying their metabolic status. We thank ParoScience for the sponsorship of this study providing the Firesting setup. Financial support for this project is provided by European Union and University of Copenhagen. We also thank the Marine Biology Section, the Ecophysiology Team at the Scientific Center of Monaco, and the University of Milano Bicocca for their valuable contribution and assistance in facilitating this research.